Hello, and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once-a-day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is number 787, the category Friday Night Pub Quiz number 8. This is the 21-question trivia quiz where all of the questions come from random categories. They're a little bit easier than the Brainy Tuesday. In fact, I think today's going to be pretty easy once you get past the first half. So, good luck on today's quiz. Question number one. The ACA is the American Association of what kind of doctor that specializes in pain reduction and health maintenance through manipulations of the spinal cord and other joints in the human body? The ACA is the American Chiropractor Association. Question number two. What is the name of the British mystery writer known for her 66 detective novels and 14 short story collections who wrote the classics Mousetrap and Murder on the Orient Express? Her name is Agatha Christie. Question number three. If you were to take two toy pyramids with square bases and join them so the bases are glued together, what term describes the resulting polyhedron that has eight faces? A polyhedron with eight faces is an octahedron. Question number four. In mythology, it was a city near the mouth of the Mediterranean that sunk into the sea. On the television show Stargate, it is a city built by the ancients in the Pegasus Galaxy. What is the name of this city? The city we're looking for is Atlantis. Question number five. The higher the number, the more compression the fuel can withstand. What is the name of the rating used as a standard measure of a fuel's ability to withstand compression in an internal combustion engine without detonating? That is the octane rating, octane. Question number six. The name instead derives from the Old English and Germanic languages. What is the name of the only planet in our solar system whose English name does not derive from the Greek or Roman mythology? The answer is Earth. Just Earth. Question number seven. These mammals carry their young in pouches. What is the name for the class of mammals that includes bandicoots, moles, kangaroos, wombats, and wallabies? The answer is marsupial. Question number eight. It was found by French troops in Lower Egypt in 1799 during the Napoleonic campaign. What is the name of this slab of black basalt that allowed hieroglyphics to be translated?
The answer is the Rosetta Stone. Question number nine. His three sons were named Shem, Ham, and Japheth. Who is this biblical man who was saved from a deluge by building a ship on which he placed his family and two of each animal? His name is Noah. Question number 10. The highest temperature ever recorded in the United States was at what California site that was named by a party of gold seekers when several members of their party did not survive the crossing of it? Several members died while crossing, so they called it Death Valley. Question number 11. One way to make it is the worsted system. Another involves shearing, washing, dyeing, carding, spinning, and weaving it. What is this fiber used to make cloth from the curly coats of sheep and other animals? The answer is wool. Question number 12. Its blue and white sections come together at Khartoum in the Sudan. What is the name of this river on whose fertile banks the Egyptian civilization was built? The name of that river is the Nile, the Nile River. Question 13. Stephen Hawking wrote a brief history of it while Madeline L'Engle put a wrinkle in it. What is this specific word that is also the title of a red-bordered American news magazine? A brief history of time, and a wrinkle in time, and Time Magazine. Time is the answer. Question 14. Often reaching magnitudes almost as great as the original tremor, what term describes subsequent ground movements that are known to occur after a major earthquake? The term we're looking for is an aftershock. Question 15. Based on a 4th century poem that was expanded during the Ming Dynasty, what is the name of the girl who disguises herself as a man to serve in the army in her father's place? The answer is Mulan. Question 16. Her favorite teacher is Miss Honey. Her least favorite headmistress is Agatha Trunchbull. What is the name of this title character of a Roald Dahl work who has the power to make inanimate objects move? Her name is Matilda. Question 17. In history, there were French, Glorious, Russian, October, and Industrial ones. In video games, there is a home front type and a dance dance type. 
What is this word? That also means an overthrow of the government. All of those are types of revolutions. Dance, dance, revolution. Question number 18. It was designed around 280 BC during the reign of Ptolemy II. What is the name of this structure, one of the seven wonders of the ancient world that served as a guide to passing ships? The answer is the Lighthouse of Alexandria. Question 19. Those in an aircraft can see the full circle, which is called a glory, but ground observers only see the top half. What is this phenomenon caused by the refraction of light by raindrops, usually when the sun appears after a storm? If you didn't get this one, it's because you overthought it. The answer is rainbow. Question number 20. He is a fictional representation of the ruling political party in George Orwell's 1984, who is said to be watching you. What is his name that is also the name of a CBS reality show in which viewers watch contestants trapped in a house? His name is Big Brother. Alright, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia. Check back tomorrow. We'll be doing another trivia quiz. Don't quote me, but I think tomorrow is The Mummy Movies. It's a Saturday night at the movies, and we've had a suggestion they would like to do some mummy trivia. I guess now that I'm thinking about it, they said they wanted to do trivia on mummy. The mummy. Hopefully they meant the movie mummies and not the actual mummies because that's what I'm going to write the trivia on. The mummy and the mummy returns and the different branches because I, I think then they had the scorpion king. Either way, think Brendan Fraser mummy, not actual ancient Egypt mummy. Check back on Saturday for that. And I don't recall right now what we're doing on Sunday, but then Monday starts a whole new week of trivia with the Brainy Tuesdays, the Who Am I Wednesdays. We're going to do a few more of those before we switch it over. We had another suggestion, a great suggestion, of Where Am I? We'll do that on Wednesday. Not this Wednesday, but coming up on Wednesdays, we will do Where Am I Trivia where I will describe where I'm at and you will guess, I don't know if it's the place or the state or the country, I'm not sure how we'll do it yet, but where am I Wednesdays coming soon. All right, what you've been waiting for, question 21, the tiebreaker for Friday Night Pub Quiz Trivia. It is a Turkish word meaning Lord and in 1206, a Mongolian ruler named Genghis assumed the title. What is this word whose wrath Captain Kirk faced in the second Star Trek movie? Captain Kirk faced the wrath of Khan in Star Trek II. And the Mongolian ruler was Genghis Khan. Thank you for watching today's trivia. Check back tomorrow and have a great weekend.